I was blown away when I saw the video how quickly it was done. 20 seconds. That's how long it took from when the suspected catalytic converter thief got out of the car until they were back in it with the sought after piece of metal. Um, so I try to be vigilant, uh, but you know, I slipped up and they got me. Coleman Ryan's catalytic converter was stolen early Tuesday morning outside of his southwest Houston home. The one day he happened to park in the street instead of the garage. The thieves are, um, they've, they've stepped it up a notch. We've got a lot of new players and that's the scary part. Sergeant Tracy Hicks with HPD has been an auto theft investigator for 16 years. He explains they are seeing a shift, more violence now coming with car theft crimes. We're seeing, you know, people who used to rob people now stealing Cadillac murders. Well, people that rob people, they're used to carrying a gun to work, you know, what they do. His advice, snap a picture of the thieves' license plates if you can do so safely, but do not confront them. It's not worth it. <laughs> Coleman Ryan, though he's out $1,000 and may be waiting months for a replacement part, is thankful that's the extent of his loss. I wouldn't go out there and confront someone, not after that deputy was killed. I mean, you've got a, a, a well-seasoned veteran officer, highly trained. You think I would stand a chance? <laughs> it's, it's not worth losing your life. Courtney Carpenter, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.